looks like we've got our first new look at the Flash Season 5 suit, guys. And it looks interesting welcome to a new flash video speedsters now today's video is all about that that new speedster suit i just teased it a second ago i mean one thing i love about it i love how it's more tight fit and it and it's more and i've always wanted this anyway uh over like for example ezra miller's plated flash suit is the more clothy fabricy kind of comic book accurate suit that barry allen wears in the comics he doesn't really wear leather it, it, it's just some kind of texturized fabric but yeah as you can see that it's just the top half of the suit we don't fully know what the legs look like bottom half still has the red boots we're not getting the yellow boots apparently and that there is the gold around the top so i i guess that means the gold kind of trimming we had around the top edges of the boot just like in season four they've maintained that instead of making the whole boots uh, gold and in a recent video i said i don't even know if the gold boots would be pulled off on the show maybe it'd be too distracting maybe ma the material they might go with might be just too in your face if they were to actually do that so maybe it was the best option to just maintain a little bit of a gold trimming at the top but also as i briefly mentioned earlier it is just made up of the panels that are sewn together and as you can clearly see and i don't know why this didn't jump out on me at first but we got teased this before as well through grant gustin saying that the first few seasons uh were two-piece suits and we were thinking oh does this mean season five suit is not a two-piece suit well lo and behold guys there is no zipper in the middle so it looks like there is no like jacket version to the flash that we're getting and that is one of the biggest complaints amongst like oh the cw leather look to the superheroes uh that we got with this costume that from people who don't really like it or just were critiquing it is that you know it was a two-piece it, it had a zipper down the middle but now it's going to be more like a jumpsuit or like a onesie if you will so i wonder just how that will look i, I think it's going to be very interesting i mean i definitely dig some parts to it and i know this isn't like completely finished so i'm hoping with this and and some elements that i like on it uh it, it will look even better in person and, and obviously this is uh a photo that was taken where they weren't planning potentially for a photo to be taken or weren't necessarily thinking that this is what they wanted to show out to the public fairly obviously this is not the photo they would want to go with so you just have to bear in mind that what we're seeing right here isn't exactly what they want you to see it's obviously going to look better from a different angle it's going to obviously look better anyway when it's probably finished because this definitely doesn't look too finished so definitely just bear that in mind before you type in the comments down below completely uh, wanting to light this suit on fire maybe now as for the cowl aspect of the suit it definitely seems that this is now a detached helmet kind of style thing so instead of barry you know having that attached hood bit to his suit i'm thinking that it will just literally lift it off but also you may notice that something else is missing the chin strap it's just it's just gone it's completely gone now that's one of the main things obviously with this suit that you kind of first notice it's like wait what where's the bit that just literally goes on his chin and stops right there like the chin strap it's just completely gone and it does look very weird and this is the thing that made me think okay i'm really not so sure about this at, at first glance um it definitely does look more reminiscent of ezra miller's suits for example the photo you're seeing on screen right now uh ezra miller's flash costume did not have a chin strap uh like grant gustin's barry allen has had in a cw's flash for the past four seasons it looks like they're finally getting rid of that now and this means he will especially if it is more of a helmet styled um flash helmet if you will um will be able to move his head a lot more supposedly grant gustin didn't really like wearing the the chin strap uh, side of the cow and and maybe this was a part of his own request because after all when you're five seasons in you can have a lot more of a say on the show than you do in the first season so maybe this has got quite a bit to do with grant gustin but at the same time you know in some comic books he hasn't actually got the, the chin strap right up to there but i do have to admit it does look a bit off now what we do know guys from Brian gustin is that that the new flash suit will be coming out of the new flash ring if you remember in the trailer nora allen said oh i have a backup when barry said i i, I don't have a suit and then she gives him the flash ring and then even uh grant gustin himself on instagram has said but in that moment barry's thinking oh new suit who this you know so i think in that moment Barry is going to get his brand new suit and this will be it. And who knows, he might make a speed streak, run into it and put it on that way. And then it will just be wearing it, you know, literally going like this. And it'll be a really cool moment. And hopefully it will look a lot cooler than what it does here. But the thing is, I do appreciate with the direction they're going. As I said, the biggest thing I'm not sure about is the helmet. 
But if they're going more towards a comic book accurate kind of Flash, and this suit definitely looks a lot more brighter. I know the Flash Season 4 suit was brighter anyway, but this does look a little bit more ready in the comics red uh, as for the Scarlet Speedster. But I appreciate how bold they're going and how, you know, it's not the leather look. It's definitely a texturized spandex material, and there's going to be more put on this, I'm sure. I definitely want to see more gold up here. The neck piece I haven't mentioned yet is another thing I'm not so sure about. It's just kind of like slightly off from the suit and the spandexy kind of material they're going with. But the one thing I have been thinking with this in terms of the timeline, Barry in 2024 has a chin strap suit. So is this another plot hole? Because technically the flash ring will be from the future that Nora gives to Barry. If this suit comes out of the flash ring, this is a future flash suit. But at the same time, I don't know, it's just like, I guess they'll address it and, you know, things change throughout the show that you could argue would change the suit and stuff like that. But as you can clearly see, this suit is much, much different to the 2024 suit. And I know we can't always keep using the 2024 news article of the Flash going missing in, you know, the, the crisis or whatever um, as, as a reference point. But at the end of the day, it, it is still in the show and it's still being presented as like, you know, the timeline is still intact, you know, this is Barry running towards whatever. So I don't know, guys, I would love to know your thoughts there. But ultimately, I would love to know your thoughts on this suit. Are you down with it? Are you kind of down with knowing that this isn't the final, final, final product? And it's just a rough look. This is clearly in like a costumey kind of testing department where they're only kind of looking at what it could look like. It might not even be the final, final, final product. But apparently this photo was from July. So that's quite close to filming ish. They didn't need it as of then straight away. So they might have had quite a bit of time to improve it. So you more being kind of apprehensive about it or are you more just like screw this screw this just the completely bad no no what are they doing what are they thinking just no other than that everyone if you enjoyed this video i'd really appreciate it if you hit that like button if you're brand new to this channel why not subscribe for more flash season 5 videos just like this be sure to expand the description box down below so you can follow me on twitter if you haven't done so already and maybe even consider pledging to my patreon uh, to support this channel even further and also guys if you missed out on my last flash video be sure to click the card up there but i think that is everything so thank you so much for watching this video i hope you have a lovely rest of your day and i'll see you in the next one goodbye